what's good, y'all? It's old school, that young dude with more wisdom than an old fool, CEO of Two Square ENT LLC, man. Man, I'm just getting off of work, man. I'm seeing some crazy stuff on the internet. I guess I'm a little bit late because the, the post I seen was like uh, three months ago. I don't know. What does this say? This says six months. It might be a little older. I don't know. I'm just now seeing this. But, man, this dude ain't like my top five favorite. Maybe not that close. But he's definitely like, he's a dope artist. I've listened to a lot past couple years so this is a big shocker bro like man what is this <laughs> but what, what do y'all think about this though because like i feel like after i listen to some people talk about it i feel like this wasn't no accident that his sex tape leaked out and it just so happened to be some uh homosexual content I feel like it's an agenda. Like every single rapper is coming out is coming out gay. And then I heard just some other dudes uh, came out gay too. Somebody used to be signed to Gucci Man, seen in the Vlad interview. But man, what, I, what's up with this agenda? Is is it an agenda? But you know what? Like I say about 10, 15 years ago, I seen a video with Professor Griff, who used to be with, uh, Public Enemy the rap group back in the day, and he was saying in a couple years, niggas was gonna start coming out with dresses and being gay and all this and that. And ever since he said that, well, the first thing that happened was uh, Wayne kissed Birdman. We all know that. Then started wearing uh, women's pants. And a lot of y'all gonna say, oh, it wasn't women's pants, it's just skinny jeans. But I, I, I remember when that stuff people first was doing that and where it came from was the skaters okay the skaters was wearing women's pants because either someone in the skating world was doing it or they just they they use the excuse that oh it, it helps them skate better but i don't see how because like man i don't know seem real constricted <laughs> hey but man and after that, you start seeing people like ASAP Rocky, some dresses and stuff. You got certain NBA players and movie stars with kids is uh, coming out saying that they're homosexual. And like, it just seemed like an agenda to me because now it's like every single body. And then like you hear like some rappers and movie stars that you don't hear from for a while. They'll speak on why, and, and they'll say something along the lines like, well, you know, you got to swing that way in order for you to get limelight. And uh, at first when I heard this, I was like, man, they just saying that because they falling off. And, you know, they being haters. But looking at this, man, and every single person coming out, and then you see how big uh, that one dude, Nas X, got. I feel like, man, it's, to me, Okay, we could look at it like, oh, well, more people's coming out, so it's just coming more acceptable. We can look at it like that. But the way it's being pushed, and then you say anything about it, like, it's like, oh, you hate people. Like, nah, I don't hate people. I just think your decision making, I hate your decision making because it's backwards, you know? It was male and female. It's, it's not, you know what I'm saying? That's it. It's male and it's female. That's it. You know what I'm saying? So for you to go against that, to me, is not logical. It's kind of, I don't want to speak too much on it because I ain't trying to get canceled. It's cancel culture. That's why I say it's, I think it's more agenda than it is just accidental or just coincidental because, like, you can't say nothing about it or you a hateful person and all this that and the third everybody's coming out saying yeah about like 10 15 years ago 
Professor Griff was on a video. They talk think it was like self-destruction, hip hop, something about hip hop destroying the black community. And he said there was going to be an agenda that was going to come out, and everybody's going to be pushing and promoting it to lessen the population of black, so-called blacks, and by you know. Uh, no more heterosexual sex, no more offspring, no more of us, or you know, like diseases and stuff, because all that stuff causes disease, and that's where they say AIDS come from. So, it's something to think about. Everybody's coming out saying that they are. Or like Kendrick Lamar, man, he let me down this year too, cause he got what I think two whole songs where he just dedicating songs to that. Or no, nah, he dedicate one song like that, and then he had that Jesse dude off in one, and it's like he making these people heroes because their sexual preferences. And I feel like they the only people that can do it. That's my problem with it, because if I just came out and tell people, oh, I like big booty girls that, that can squirt and all this and that and I like brown skinned Mexican girls and like Indonesian girls and like I just told everybody my sexual preferences I feel like I'll get bashed and everybody like that's not decent and that's out of order and, and, and you know that's not uh what's the word um that's inappropriate but they can go out and be like oh yeah I like dudes and you know I'm married to dudes and all that you know, or vice versa, and then everybody's, oh, you're, you know, making them seem like, oh, you're so brave, and you're a hero, why, because, man, <laughs> man, 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 but what do y'all think, though, what, I want to hear what y'all think, you know what I'm saying, is it a conspiracy, is it just a coincidence, or is it not a big deal, and who cares at all, but you know, everything affects everything you know i feel like being a kid being a teenager you can think oh it's, it's my you know I, I can do whatever i want blah 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 you know and it don't affect nobody but it affects the kids it affects everything it, it, and, it, and it you know from what they've been telling us all these years is it causes more diseases too so you know what i'm saying it affects everything you do affect everybody you know what i'm saying and like, even if that's your, your preference, I don't understand why everyone else has got to accept it and why you've got to just let everybody know. Like, why can't you just keep that to myself, keep that to yourself? Like I was saying, like, I can't go around and be like, oh, yeah, hey, hey, how you doing? Yeah, my, my name's da 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 Yeah, can I tell you how I like big booty holes? And, you know, I like the, the, the brown skin big booty holes, the Mexican bros, the Indian bros, which I do, by the way. But I'm saying, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. Y'all just let, let me know what y'all think in the comments. Put in the comments. Let's talk about this. <laughs>